I'm going to be taking a look today at some of the extras that came in the Crossmaster Arena Frygost Expansion Kickstarter. Some of the additional tokens and terrain that came in resin, a little plush, some of the extra large cards, dice, some different tokens, and the alternate terrain. So we'll start out by looking at the alternate terrain. You can see you got some of the ice cubes here that have just kind of ribbons on them like they're packaged up as a uh, present. You got some Christmas trees, snowmen, like we have a little box here that's going to be uh, another present. Some little uh, snow covered boulders with some, I guess those are frozen icicles or some sort of frozen foliage. So you're going to get two of these and the only real difference seems to be the color of the box there. Uh, you also get some different colors on your uh, ice cubes there. You also have some, what I'm guessing are comma coins there. I'm not sure if there's something else those could be. I got these with it. These are the metalized comma coins that um, I think they were also available in the first picture. But I have one of those open. and just take a quick look at it. Let me see. It's just a uh, it's not really metal, I think it's some sort of plastic or whatever, it's just got the gold to make it look metal. Also got the uh, metal gallons of glory. And those are like the uh, objective pieces in the game. You know, you collect those till you get a certain amount, you win. And I have one of those opened up also. Now these do feel metal, whether they are or not, I don't know. But they do have a heftier weight to them. They also have that metal sound to them. They could be some other material, but those actually do feel metal. I guess the comma coins could be metal, they're so light, they feel like a more of a plastic with a just a paint coating. This feels metal also. It's cool to the touch. This is the collector's coin that came with the Kickstarter. You can see it's got the Count Frogost or Count Herborg. I'm not sure which one that is. He's the main character for the expansion. He's actually the only character that comes with the expansion itself. And then you got the Crossmaster K on the back. We have the plushie that came with it. So you can see he's about the size of an adult male hand there. It's a little plush tofu. You have some of the extra large cards. So you have the character that comes in the Frygost expansion here and that's Count Hairborg. You have Count Frygost. He is a promo that you could uh, get. You got I got him through the Kickstarter, but I guess you could get him through whatever special events they're running, or on the uh, secondary market maybe. We have Wack Fu Terminatot, and that's another promo. We have Stasis Terminatot, another promo. You have Gold with Terminatot. He's another promo also. But I believe he's extremely hard to get. I believe you... I forget what the requirements. You have to play a game with the creator of the game or something to that effect. But it's uh, he was not available through the Kickstarter. They have uh, some sort of special means to get him. They're very rare. We have Lumino. And the next six are going to be part of the multi-man expansion, which can be bought separately. So it's not a, a promo figure. We have Lumino, Corbax, Scale, Trank, Billsbug, and Shadow. And those were all the multi-man expansion. And then you have some of the promos that came along with this 
round of figures or in this expansion we have Grampy and we have Carob Crepin Joris and Lou and then the last two we have here part of another expansion called the It's this expansion here. I'm not sure, it's kind of like a little starter box, but it's got Mercator and Captor, Captain Amanka. Amakana. So these are the two extra large cards for those. But since this, uh, this stuff was all kind of released at the same time, this was kind of the package of extra large cards that you could get at the time. We have the dice that came along with this particular Kickstarter, and they're the clear dice, just in yellow and green. The initial Kickstarter had dice available in blue and pink. We have some of the terrain that came along with it. We have a little resin ice cube here. We got six of those with the Kickstarter. We have a little geyser. And I got six of those. We have the snow tree, and I got three of those in the resin set. We have a dead tree here with snow on it. And I don't know the names of these specific tokens, but these are some tokens that can be used when the characters use their special abilities or spells. We have like a little raccoon fox looking guy here. You have kind of an abominable snowman or a yeti. Kind of running on his hands there. Huge forearms and hands. Tiny little feet. Almost looks like a baboon in the winter. And you just got one of each of these that I'm showing right now. You have kind of the dazed and confused bird here. Have a sheep here. Kind of like a ram instead of a sheep though. And you have the big angry bird. Like a little staff. And these next few you get multiples of. These are like a an ice tofu. You get three of those in the resin set. These are some sort of other little penguin looking bird. And I got three of these in the resin token set. And this is some sort of clockwork bird. And I've got four of these from the token set. So that's a look at some of the Kickstarter extras from the Crossmaster Arena Frygos expansion. I know some of these, like the the resin tokens and terrain, can be acquired through other means, like at some of their promos or events or whatever else. Uh, some of the rest of this that may be exclusive. You'll probably be able to buy the plush at some point in time. Uh, metalized stuff, I think you can acquire through, uh, you know, when they're at conventions or they have uh, events that you can play for. They have either have them as prizes or you know goodie bag kind of things but again that's everything or that's some of the stuff that I got as extras for the Crossmaster Arena of Frygos expansion just as an addendum to that I do have this case that I got when the Kickstarter came out all this this wasn't a reward this is something I added on and bought afterward and I'm sure you could probably buy this from them just off their website but this is the Frygos themed case and it's just uh, you know it's got the metal edging but the uh, material here is almost like a really hardened press board or cardboard the uh, you can see you just have a couple of latches here and you open it up 
and it's just got two of these trays in it. So you can see it's one, two, three, four, five, six. So it's only got 27 pieces here and 27 times two. So that's how many pieces you could actually put in here. I don't know how the characters actually fit, but the tokens and stuff could fit in here also. But that's just something else I got during the Kickstarter. That wasn't actually part of the rewards. <laughs>